and uh, away they go from the 1600. Looks like Son of Silver said no as the starter said go, and Son of Silver's tailed off. MacDessie's right there, Lysian Park fighting for his head in the first furlong. Soldiers Code towards the inside, Argyle Band, Cat Side, Slew's also got his head up in the air. Number of fighters, Argos Jets also keen to the inside. Breakfast Club, Command to Conquer's taken a hold around them. San Julian Bay, so a number of runners in early trouble here. Towards the back end, hearts are pumping. MacDessie has won the bridle in front and MacDessie goes off to lead by a length and a quarter. Soldiers Code is racing second in the orange silks. Elysian Park towards the inside. Command to Conquers three around. Cat side slew one in and back. Then comes Golden Fort, San Julian Bay. Argyle Bay, they team up together in tight quarters. They come to team at only four lengths off. Argos Jet and then comes Breakfast Club, only five lengths off. Hearts are pumping. Son of Silver's caught up, but he's used up a lot of energy. Whipping them for home is MacDessie by a length and a quarter. Soldiers Code is right there, pressing at his quarters in second. Elysian Park goes towards the inside. Cat side slew to the stand side. Coming to the 300 meter marker now. Soldiers Code pours on the pressure. Cat side slew Argyle Bay looking to run on. Elysian Park's on the inside. Argos Jet and Breakfast Club running on. Soldiers Code, the last hundred looking to last. Golden Fort with big strides is coming home. 100 meters left to go. Breakfast Club, Soldiers Code and Golden Fort. Soldiers Fort on the inside. Soldiers Code fought them off. Golden Fort second. Breakfast Club and Argyle Bay. So fighting them off is Soldiers Code, Golden Fort, Golden Fort and Soldiers Code. Breakfast Club on the inside comes through late. Number two, the favourite, Soldiers Code, fights them off. Golden Fort is going to get close as they run down to the line. It's going to be a long neck. Soldiers Code, number two, wins it. Anthony Del Pege. Golden Fort, second. Breakfast Club, Argyle Bay, Argos Jet, Catside Slew. MacDessie, San Julian Bay. So, looking to fight them all off as Soldiers Code down the middle of the course. Golden Fort's running on, but Soldiers Code, he's got a little bit more to offer over the last 75. Golden Fort Breakfast Club, Soldiers Code in front, and he'll do just enough. He fought on courageously to deny Golden Fort. On the inside, Breakfast Club, Argyle Bay, that's the running of race number six. Two soldiers code is coming the son of Western Winter for trainer Dean Kanameya. And the stable's been boxing along the entire day. A lot of places earlier on today, but they put the one on the board. And I haven't chatted to Dean in a while. Of course, Barbara doing duty. Uh, Dean, a busy man these days, shuttling between uh, KZN and Cape Town. But officially, I'd like to congratulate him on air. He recently tied the knot. So, uh, Dean, uh, well done with that. For the guys that don't know the public, uh, uh, congratulations. Oh, geez, thank you very much. I'm sure most of the public knew that, actually. Because I'm like Mark Saxon, I've got nowhere to hide. <laughs> okay. Uh, coming back uh, to uh, this uh, individual uh, today, he won a good race with Eric last time out. Yeah, oh, apprentice race, you know, he's a genuine horse, you know, he hangs in there all the way. And I mean, today it was, was quite difficult for Anthony because he, he sometimes over races, you know. He, uh, you could see he was pulling, he was battling to make him drop the bit. And I actually thought the saddle was going to go over his wither. But uh, nevertheless, um, he took control of it and uh, he fought on all the way to the line. So uh, he's the number four time winner, you know, and uh, so well done to, uh, to the whole partnership, you know, and uh, Ed Bow and, and Bryn Russell and, and Mars Shirtliff. So um, I remember a couple of months ago, you know, he, he won a race, a maiden race, and he was... He got stuck for a while, and uh, but he's, he's bounced back. So, uh, you know, he's, he's he's a genuine type of horse. So it can become frustrating when you see all these seconds for the day. But this horse has put you on the board, and you got one more left. Last Tiger and the next. Yeah, we have got Last Tiger, Mr. Winston. Mr. Winston, I think a mile is probably too sharp for him, and uh, his second run back after a long break, and then I'll, I'll run him over ground after this. And uh, Last Tiger, you know, he loves the poly, he comes out fresh. Uh, but you know, he uh, his horse had arrived in, in Durban a year ago. It was a 67 hours and 90. So, uh, as I said to my partner, Michael Galp, it's going to become more and more difficult. But he does love the poly over a mile, and, uh, and uh, I think uh, you, you can't leave him out. The one stat that interests me is that he comes out fresh. Each time you bring him out, he seems to find his best form. I absolutely loves to come out fresh. You know, he was always at, at aches and pains early on in his career, and 
Uh, Mike's been very patient with us, so uh, yeah, just you've got to respect those. But but he, he is slowly but surely going up the weights. But he's you know he's earned his stripes. Give our best to the honours, Dean. But before you leave, um, we've uh, touched on your horses. Some of them needing their runs, but things uh, seem to be coming to hand now. And you you've brought in some more stock from Cape Town as well. Well, I moved horses around. You know, I brought uh, some horses went back to Cape Town. You know, the uh, for the summer season, and, uh, and I moved some horses back uh, last Thursday, right on Friday. And uh, I've just come back, I've, I left Cape Town yesterday, just, you know, just for the day, yeah, and then I'll be back in Cape Town tomorrow morning. And um, so I'll just be up and down, Barbara will carry on, so I'll just oversee as we did over the last two years. Well done, yeah, Dean, and all the best in the next as well. Dean, thank you very much, thank you. Well done, trainer Dean Kanamea with number two, Soldiers Code. Uh, that full result, two, six, three, and ten, that's the way they cross the line, race number six. Coming up next, race number seven, Closing off this afternoon's jackpot.